My name is Alex Keeler. Uh, I'm originally from Wolfen, Nova Scotia, but I live in Sherbrooke and have done so for the last 10 years. Uh, I make a living as a musician. I play this fabulous instrument that's called the Nicola Harpa, but I also play fill and uh, mandola. So I guess you could say I'm a multi-instrumentalist. Um, and I do a fair bit of teaching as well. The pandemic has sort of made everybody take time to stop and think about what kind of a system we have, what are the times we live in. Especially for, for musicians like myself, it's interesting, you know, a lot of my colleagues and I have sort of just gone, wow, what's going on here? All of a sudden, my calendar's empty and I have all this time to think, whereas it's, it's a rat race, usually. It's, you know, six months, if not a year, if not two years ahead of time, what your schedule is going to look like. Uh, the way the system is 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 organized is pretty precarious um, if you're uh, you're trying to make a living doing this. So the pandemic has made us think about the conditions during the pandemic, but above and beyond. So I'm part of this group called ART, Artistes pour la reconnaissance de la rémunération équitable. Right now the, the crux of our struggle is to review the laws surrounding the, the work conditions that musicians have. Ariane Delion uh, is an artist that has drafted a parliamentary memoir. The Minister of Culture asked for people to do that so that she, as a consultation so that in the next few parliamentary sessions they can try to revisit those laws. And possibly find a system that's different. For instance, in France, there's a guaranteed minimum income for musicians. To be eligible for it, you have to have a certain number of days where you're working, but the rest of the time uh, you're eligible for a subsidy. So it's kind of like unemployment insurance, in a sense. Means, what, what does it mean to be a musician? Well, the reality is you spend about 20% of your time practicing and performing and then 80% of your time doing connex uh, tasks that aren't paid. <laughs> or if you're not careful, they're not paid. So the, the, the whole recording industry has changed so much with streaming and digital media. And musicians, musicians, you know, it's a career that's existed for centuries, right? And so to be successful as a musician, you're adaptive, you, you evolve. Um, but conditions have probably never been great. So maybe now is the time for us to say, okay, well, you know, conditions are better in other professions, so why can't we reclaim what could be ours? Mm -hmm.